Am I in frame now? Okay, are we recording now? Are we recording? <laughs> when you're ready. When, yeah. Recording. Good. <laughs> Earlier in the week, I posted the written instructions for the wrecked kettlebell workout. This is a compound kettlebell workout. You only need one or two bells. If you need to lighten up, I'm gonna work really hard to stick with my 35 for this. I actually don't think I've ever filmed a kettlebell workout from beginning to end with me doing every single rep, every second. So this is the first of its kind. You're welcome. <laughs> Here we go. Um, I have already warmed up with a half a mile run. I encourage you to warm up somehow, do some mobility work, some dynamic stretching before you knock this one out. You need your water. If you've got chalk, I suggest you chalk up. <laughs> Our first set is 10 swings, five Americans, and then you rest 20 to 30 seconds between rounds. I'm gonna punch my timer for every rest. If you need more time, just take it and jump in with me on the next round. So here we go, setting up for 10 swings. Okay, so slightly turned out, you're gonna hinge. Make sure you squeezy booty on your swings. Nine, ten, add five Americans. Push five, four, three, two, and one. Park your bell. First rest. So I'm going to set an aggressive pace here with 20 seconds rest between rounds. We got to do that four more times. Here we go again. Here's three, two, one. Push that first American, push. Last one. Park at rest. Three more times. So remember, make sure you're squeezing. Hands are soft in your swings. Three, two, one, here we go. Five Americans, all the way up. And park it safely. Two more times. All right, here we go, about five seconds for round four. Three, two, one. Big swing. Three, two, one. Take this one. Open the elbows. Engage the core. Last one. Control it down. There you go. 20 seconds rest. All right, five seconds. Last set of swings. Push it. Three, two, one. Last. Big five. OK, 
can you do one more? There you go. Punch in that rest. And we're gonna hit set number two. It's snatches and sumo deadlift high pulls. If you can't do a snatch, you're gonna sub with the high pull. So let me show you what that looks like. Here's the high pull. Up. Okay. Five each arm. If you're not trying for the snatches, which I am. All right. You ready to hit it? Choose your option. High pull or snatches. Five each side, followed by five sumo deadlift high pulls. Here we go. Three, two, one. One. Pulls. Ready? Sink into those heels. Pull. Four. Three. Two. One. Rest. Four more times. Now you know what we're doing. Get comfortable with it. Remember on your snatches, if you're doing these, pull from your hip, rotate that elbow, and release. Here we go. Pull from the hip, release. Other side. How this snatch is treating you, huh? Here we go. Pull and push. We got this. More than halfway done with this set. This one might be the hardest one. Let's find out. seconds here we go I'm getting tired so I'm gonna start with my weak arm knock it out first one four back. Just for it. Last one. There you go. All right. 
We have one more. Okay? I'm here with you every second. Committing, commit right now. We're gearing up. Here we go. Power from the bottom. That's what I'm talking about. Five more. I'm done. That one's done. You tell how excited I am to be done with that. <sighs> Next one won't be so bad. We've got five single arm swings each arm and 10 front presses. No, five. Heavy charm, five presses. All right, are you ready? Now I got 10, five each side here. Four, three, two, and one, push it. Four, three, two, and one. Five overhead, you ready? Two, one. Perfect. 20 seconds rest. So on your single arm swings, make sure you're still pushing high. Okay, don't let the bell drop to the knees. Stay high. All right, here we go. Hook that thumb, right, thumb over your index finger. Push. Awesome. All right. Move right along. So we're on the third, third set of exercises here. We're more than halfway done. Here we go. Single arm swing. Two more rounds, we got it. Here we go. Three, two, one, round four, push. Four, four, three, two, one. Other side, push it, five. Four, three, two, one. Oh, you see that? Here's the push. Awesome. We 
it one more time. This feels like cake compared to those snatches, right? Chocolate cake. Last one, number five. Starting with my left for five, four, three, two, one. Move it on. Set of exercises number four. We're gonna take high pulls. So if you did high pulls already for snatches, you could swap alternating swings if you want, or you can just double up here with high pulls again. Alrighty. So you're pulling nice and high. Five, four, three. Double back, two, and one. Four, three, two, and one. Bicep curls, hold the sides of that bell. Elbows in tight, five, four. Twenty seconds rest. I got that energy. Still going. Keep it high. Four more rounds. I'm going to alternate my starting arm. I'm going to alternate. So I'm going to start with the lift this time. Remember to use that hook grip right here. Hinging at the hips. Draw that core in tight. Pull. Three. Two. And one, other side. Last one, nice. Back into curls, here you go. Whew. 20 seconds rest. Grab a drink. We're about to start round three. I think so. Here's three. Here we go. Sit up is important. Sit up. Pull. You should be feeling this in all around your trunk right here, but not down deep. If it's down deep, lighten up. 
and make sure that you're activating your abs and your glutes. Last set of this. We got it, here we go. We are on set five, which happens to be on the mat. So, whenever you're ready, join me down on the floor. We have five chest presses, 10 chest presses, 10 chest presses, five roll ups. I'm ready. So safely retrieve your bell, holding it by the bell part. And we're gonna take 10. Three, two, and one. Just keep it lifted, extend the legs. Let's take these weighted roll ups. You know what? I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it with 35 on all those roll ups, but we'll find out. Resting. <laughs> we got to do this four more times. This is a good rest. Here we go. One more. All right, let's see about this. All right, number three, here we go. I'm with you. We're here. We're strong. Ten. Here we go. One more. Oh, oh man. That's brutal. We have two more. Here we go. Chest presses, number four. Here we go. One more.
One more. I'm really having to dig deep on these rolls with the 35 pound bell, friends. Um, when you do this, let me know what weight you're using. And we have one more. One more. Finish strong. That's what I'm talking about right there. Sometimes it's tough. But if you're not challenging yourself, you're not changing yourself. So with my warm up there, this wrap under 30 minutes. Make sure you really stretch on those arms. Stretch out those triceps. Maybe take a cool down walk. Stretch out the back of the leg. Show the hips some love right here. Stretch it out. And then we're gonna roll it up. Take those shoulders up, down, and back. Find some balance. Triangle stretches on those hips. Well done, everybody, well done. See you next time. <laughs>